Okay, so it's giving me a maximum distance reach, but the distance it's calculating from is all the way over there. We have moved, so it's not coming back to us. Unless we can land it on somebody's boat, but that would probably piss somebody off. Land it on somebody's boat. You can land it on somebody's boat. Hi, my name's Colin. I used to be a chief engineer on super yachts, but gave it all up to buy a hurricane damaged Lagoon 450. My friends and I are fixing it up as we go and are determined to circumnavigate the entire planet. So subscribe if you want some inspiration to live life to the fullest. 20 years from now, you will be more disappointed by the things you didn't do than by the things you did. So what are you waiting for? I was afraid something like this might happen. What's happening? No, so it's just stuck back there. It's stuck within 50 meters of where I took off, which is right here. And it can't catch us. No, it can't catch us. I could drop into somebody's boat. I, Andy's boat just passed underneath, and then I didn't think about it. Are you yet. flying towards us now? I can't. I can't. I'm stuck right there. Why do you mean you're stuck? It's, it's keeping me 50 meters from where we took off. Can't so. you turn the GPS off? No, there's no way. I have to crash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You go, you go. Um, turn, turn maximum, maximum distance off. Yeah, but no limit. Yeah, see, it's set, Max. but it, they added, they add that. It's because uh, I'm not logged in, so then it just. No, it's not. It's fine. It's fine. You race, dude. We got to win this race. You're nuts. We're not. No, I mean it's gone. That important? No, it's gone. This, this drone. We have 19 minutes left. We can enjoy the view. <laughs> Are you going to try landing on it? Is that Avalon right there? No, it's not. That is that's 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 a South African boat. Yeah, I figure I shouldn't crash a drone onto somebody else's Don't let boat. Do it. Our, um, no. I think you should do it. Now. I should just land on his boat? Yes. I think that's a roof. We have four minutes to get there, and then I'm going to just try to land on that roof. I think this roof is that one over there. See those two white specks? There's a chance. No idea where this even is. All right, I'm just gonna hit land and hopefully it'll land. Land. Landing. Yes. All right, it's landing. Come on, baby. We see the shadow coming down. <laughs> no idea how we're gonna find this place. It's landing, it's landing, it's landing, it's landing. Yay. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, there's a chance. All right, after the regatta, we're gonna go look for the drone. We're coming up fast on Algria, Amanahal. Not sure what the strategy is gonna be. Are we gonna go port or starboard around them? See what's happening to those guys? Yeah. They're heading way out. Point is just point. Let's get the wind 45 plus. Yeah. Hold that uh, heading. So all of these boats here, there was a wind shift and they all got knocked down that way. So we've just, we went high and then we're going straight for the marker and they're stuck out there. So luckily we saw what the wind did to them and we acted accordingly. So we're going straight for the marker and we're going to cut all of these guys off. Don't hug this one too close. When we say let it go, just let it go slowly. All right, so we're trying to hug this buoy right here. This is the mark. We got to get just around it. Bring that in a bit if you can, just for a second. Keep here going, Tom. Keep going. Turn up a little bit. You got to keep going or else we'll, we'll hit it. Keep going. Okay, let's go. Spin it hard. Go, 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 go. Just hold it there, hold it there. Oh, that's epic. Look at that. Look, look, we just got in front of seven boats. Oh, hang on. No, we can't. Just hold this. We've got to wait to see what he does. Everybody's all crowded up right here. Look at that. Okay, now we're going. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, shit, my God. they're actually about oh, to hit. 
Tack around all here. Our lead now. Yeah. Because I know there's no wind up there. We're in the lead, fellas, you know that. <laughs> yeah! No, 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 no. This one is. Is he? Oh, yes. We're in second. <laughs> no, we did that last year. We won. <laughs> there's a chick sitting up there. Woo! The wind shift is working in our favour right now. So we're going to ride this out as long as we can. We're getting lifted that way. I don't know how to tell. Alright, it looks like we're gonna keep this tack and go around the cruise ship where Colin thinks there's a little bit more wind. Taking a chance. This is how you try to win. Keep, keep an eye on those telltales, Tom. That's good. This is like perfect right now. Is this what y'all thought sailing was? This Pretty is cool. awesome. Yeah. Pretty damn cool, huh? Can you see that curve? Yeah. We're getting lifted. Yeah, so if yeah. we tacked earlier, that curve would be going that way. So we'd be going even worse. Yeah, yeah. So we gotta, when this is happening, you just ride that shit out as long as you can. See all the other boats, they're already tacking. Everyone else will have to tack at least two or four more times. If Colin's right, this should shave quite a bit of time off for us. When we go to tack, I'll let it catch the wind, and then I'll slowly let it go as we turn, and you just pull it in quick and just crank on it. 15 knots. Do you want a can? Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know it's serious when Lena offers all the boys a can and we all say no. Okay, let's tack. You ready? Yeah. Really? Okay, ready? Okay, go. Go. Tack it. Get that wind at like 60. Go, 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 go. Get oh, it. here it goes, baby. Whoa! All right, baby, straight towards the cruise ship now. Excitement. So much craziness happening. Passing right in front of this cruise ship. Seaborne Ovation. We go right up into that anchorage. There's a chance that we can, we can lay it. So everybody's picking their different routes. Everyone's taking a chance. We won't make it yet. We gotta go right up basically to that cat. It's our only chance. We're trying to duck between this mono hall and that cat right there. It's happening now. Hard, 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 hard. Hold it. Okay, let it go. Get some speed up first, Tom. We're at 60. We're we pointing at it now. No, you gotta point higher than it, significantly higher than it. Ah, it's gonna be close. We're pinching right now just to make this mark. Otherwise we have to tack and then tack again. Oh man, it's gonna be close. Come on, baby! All right, we did it! Set 90, this is gonna be quick. Round the marker, past the pirate ship. We're behind two boats right now. These guys scooted up right next to us. Cut us off, baby. like on our beam and we actually sail really well on our beam that's our fastest point of sail so we'll just leave it at this that's a 65 foot catamaran and we're keeping up with them if not gaining on them a little bit so why change something that's working out really good and what, what happened before when we were on that cruise ship the wind was giving us a lift and then we made basically one tack all the way into the anchorage tacked again and we lay them lay the finish line so that we, we sailed that really well. We overtook every single mono hull with that one move. All right, so we got Avalon, a massive custom cat right behind us. They're gaining. We're actually in third place right now. It's pretty damn epic. 
Over there is first place. We don't know what the heck they're doing, but they're crushing it. And the guy we're trying to catch up with, bam, 65 footer. All right, so this is lap two. This is actually where our drone is. Those two little white houses. Hope it's there in an hour. Damn right on us. Oh, good job. One, one turn on the jib. We were no match for the custom 55 foot cat with dagger boards as they slowly pulled away from us, which even the dogs weren't happy about. How's it looking? Doing the best we can, we're sailing really nicely. These two guys are much bigger boats. I think we've got a 65 and a 55. We got, now we got that trimaran coming up behind us. Oh, it's catching up? Yeah. We've got half an hour after everyone. He's flying by us like we're not even moving. What do you think that try is doing? Oh, we're doing eight and a half, so he's doing level five. All right, final turn, and then it's the finish line. Okay, throw it over. Yep, done. Pretty damn good tack if you ask me. I wouldn't ask me though because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Same strategy. We're gonna duck around the front of that cruise ship over there. One tack this way, and then one tack to hit the finish line. <laughs> So we passed the cruise ship, what's the strategy? We're gonna try to sneak in front of everyone on, the, on one tack, right up to the mark, and then just pull into the finish line. It's the only way we have a chance of getting on the podium. We're in fifth place right now. If we just follow them, we'll just come in in fifth. But if we try to do something different. Yeah, crank it! Crank it! This part cracks me up. My pet peeve is people leaving the winch handles in the winches when they're not using them, but I didn't know that Daryl was using the winch next to me. So watch his confusion when the handle is suddenly moved. All right, see if we can... See if we can... So our attempt at overtaking a few boats didn't work out this time, but we also didn't get overtaken, so we remained in fifth place. You guys ready? We got a final tack into the finish line, right there. Fifth place. Yes. Good job, Matt. Dude, 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 yes. Yeah, Come on, dude. That was pretty awesome, right? You can't wait. We're racing these massive cats. It's not fair! Good job, brother. Fifth place, Carl. Fifth place. The other lagoon for fit for fifth is just coming through now. You were good. You're good. Comparatively, we did very well, I think. Jello shots! Cheers, everybody. Cheers! Cheers. How do you like that e-wincher? A lot easier. Good race, brother! Congratulations! He just today sailed solo and won the monohull class. They crushed us because they have an extra boat connected to them. Congratulations, brother! Made the win this year. It was perfect. You going over to 
the pirate ship? Yeah, can you take me? Yeah, jump on. Do you want to bend that, just in case? Picking up the winners. Thank you. Good job, good job, good Thank job. You. There we go, spinnakers away, sails are down, lines are being cleaned. I guess we're going to the pirate ship. How was it? Was it fun? Yeah, that was epic. <laughs> That's the best. Casually tied up next to a freaking pirate ship. No big deal. Let's go look for a drone. Hopefully, our drone is still here. Our drone. Drone? Uh, Remote see, control? Say, say. See, see, Aya? In the tierra, yeah. yeah, just behind. Ah, yeah. You see? Izquierda de uh, negro botellas. Grande. Right there, I see it. I see it right there. In the grass? In the grass? Yeah, you see, in between the trees and the grass. Right okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, oh, look, so she's over there already. Yeah. We can't pasar this area, so she's over there. She sees it. I see her see it. She's going to get it for us. See, <laughs> sí, gracias. Seven hundred bucks, not down the drain. <laughs> Reunited and it feels so good. Oh, it's a miracle. I cannot believe we got it. We did it, Ron. I, why do I keep on calling you Ron? Just because they're both from Canada does not mean they have the same name. Hi. Yes! <laughs> good job, buddy. We had a great time on the pirate ship, but it was time to go to the prize giving and then let loose at the after party. No, we want the girl. Hold this. Hold this. Uh, you want to race? Uh, race time, baby. Sandbaggers? He gave me hope for a second there. I thought I had a chance. Yeah, All right, award ceremony. How did you end up with a 450? Well, I watched Parlay's videos, man, and I was like, I'm time to buy a boat. <laughs> the reason he's getting thanked is not because he always has the hottest crew on board. I do appreciate that. But because he, he basically created the regatta. Three years ago, he came to us and said, hey, let's have a regatta. And uh, with his direction and a lot of help from a lot of other people, we put it together. So good to have him back in the regatta. Uh, yeah. When you win a 30-day slip at Bocas Marina. Hey, we got an award for, we call this the Perseverance Award. And it's dedicated to Parlay Revival in honor of them. So for the rest of the days that we have this regatta, uh, at least another 20 more, 20 more years. Coincidentally, when I'll be hitting my sexual crime. <laughs> Even the nine-year-olds are laughing. Fortunately, he is more handsome on YouTube than he is in person. And here's what you win. You're gonna win a, uh, a gift certificate for Nacho Mama out on the beach. Uh, uh, I guess you'll have no trouble. Uh, yeah. That's what I'm saying, that when we started this, a few years ago, we had no idea that it would turn into something like this. And to compete in our third Bacchus Regatta is just an incredible thing. The sailing community is just absolutely amazing. This place will have a special place in our heart. Thank you so much. David's had a long day. 